turn and work its way into the Atlantic. It might impact areas of the Bahamas. Currently, it's impacting areas in Cuba right now, but it's going to continue to work its way out into the ocean over the next several days and then diminish. Now for us, we're looking at higher than average temperatures. We're about uh, 10 to 11 degrees what, of over what we normally see. And as we head into next week, we'll start to slowly begin to see those temperatures dip down again. Here's another look at our Sky Watchers report. So here in Ringgold, it was 73 degrees was our high, 73 also in McDonald, 75 in East Brainerd, and then over in Delano, 82 degrees, 79 in Unica, and 72 degrees there in Turtle Town. Now, our low temperatures tonight will be in the mid to upper 40s, 49 degrees here in Chattanooga. Uh, all around the board, it's going to be a relatively clear night. We might see some of that cloud coverage. Here is a look at what is dominating our temperatures right now. We've got this high pressure system, which is just to our northeast, and it's keeping those warm temperatures around. It's keeping our rain away from our area, overall staying warm and dry and that's going to be continue to see our trend over the next couple of days all the way through Wednesday heading into tomorrow. We're looking at another high of around 79 degrees tomorrow. We're going to see lots of sunshine again. Those loop low dew points making things feel absolutely phenomenal outside. So around the board again up there staying in the upper 70s. Uh, it doesn't look like anywhere reaches the 80s tomorrow, but again just beautiful, beautiful conditions. So temperatures, of course, we're going to reach around 81 degrees Thursday. Friday will be a high of 82. Muggy meter, we're going to be still absolutely comfortable, cool conditions. So uh, it's going to be some dry air, not much moisture there. And then also taking a look as we move into the temperature trends six to 10 days out, we are still looking at above average temperatures all the way through the next 10 days. And if you're taking a look at your precipitation trends, we're starting to get a little bit closer to our average temperatures over there in West Tennessee. That's average rain chances um, then heading over for us. We're still looking at less than the average, but and again, and heading and looking over at your drought monitor, we're still in those moderate drought conditions, but uh, those severe droughts are staying away from our viewing area, fortunately. Now, taking a look at your seven day storm alert forecast, just to recap for you guys, we're looking at beautiful conditions all across the board, all the way through this week. Lots of sunshine, those warmer temperatures, not exactly sweater weather, but with low dew points, going to feel fantastic. So make sure uh, you are able to make use of that and get those outdoor activities in before it starts to get cooler.